Now we'll touch on the issue of money laundering that had caused Thailand to be blacklisted by an FATF, uh, one of the uh, task force based in France. And now let's talk to Kunwarawan Tara Poom from Bolong Securities on the line with us today. So, Adi Krab Kunwarawan. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Kun Onganan and Kun Pasukan. It's a pleasure to have you in our program. Kun Warawan, about the FATF blacklist of Thailand, do you have any updates on that story? Well, uh, the update on the the, uh, the story is too long, and I have said yes. so many times. So I will uh, summarize the effect on the stock market. Sure. There's actually, in the short term, there's no effect on the capital markets, as you can see. Uh, however, in the longer term, it will be harder for real sectors to trade internationally because other countries will need more identification and documents, right. which means time-consuming and higher costs. Mm -hmm. And thus, our competitiveness is weaker. Right. Okay, so, so how, how much influence do we get from, from this blacklist? Is it uh, going to be uh, impacting on, on the whole scale of the whole economy? For the whole I think it is not not small, not in a small scale. Right. I think it's mm -hmm. quite big. But we do not feel it right now because uh, other countries will need some time to adjust themselves mm -hmm. and consume the news. And then uh, every country in the fat F will have uh, some measure for this country, for the country in the backlist. Mm -hmm. I see. Kun yep. Warawan, uh, yeah. with, with the blacklisting, what are some suggestions to the government at this point? Like, is there less concern from the task mm -hmm. force? Well, uh, the money laundering and terrorist financing is a serious threat to the security and the integrity of the financial system. I this see. is what we know. Fed Air recommendations are the basis on which all countries should meet and share objectives of tackling mm -hmm. those activities. The government should apply stronger safeguards in the financial sector, strengthen the law enforcement tools, and improve international cooperation. So the law regarding money laundering in Thailand could be amended to allow a more effective and mm -hmm. through inspection into any financial activities. If we have clean politicians, it will be easier to push the laws out of the parliament. This is mm -hmm. my comment. Okay, so, so we start from the legal process. Yeah. Okay. And, and what, what do you compare that to um, being downgraded by the FATF uh, versus being downgraded by a credit rating agency like S&P or Moody's, which would have a more severe effect? Uh, the credit rating will have more effect right now first more sure because uh -huh. it means the cost of any company to establish a new uh, uh for example the government bond or for the company is a corporate debentures but for fat f uh -huh. it will be uh, a medium or longer term effect right and it will uh, it will lead us to the cost also because if we have to use more time uh -huh. to process in transactions cost Yes. Yeah. Okay. And so uh, you're suggesting the government to make a move by amending the laws and uh, move on from this point. So which uh, would be the appropriate terms of action for the government to do uh, from now on? Yes. So the uh, I don't know the name in English. Sorry. Okay. They have set up a, a meeting last week with Grit mm -hmm. and financial system. Uh, representative and I think they are now understand more and more uh, the all the whole people understand more and more and they we will move to correct it bring us down from those lists we don't want to be in that list uh -huh. so uh, the next step is to pass it to the um, I think to the Parliament but mm -hmm. before the Parliament it must go through the of uh, 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 law, the legal. Yeah. I think it's it, Kun uh, Chalem, he's the one who is in charge of this thing. Yes, our deputy and prime minister. Yeah. Yeah, and Kun Kibirat will help to conduct it and contact with the people. Okay. The thing in the parliament consisting of the majority in pure Thai parties. So if they uh, push this thing in the first priority, 
it will pass through the parliament easily. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's the very first action the government should be doing and yes. completing as soon as possible to prevent a long-term uh, effect on the economy. Yes. Okay, well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.